Do you wish you had more discipline to stick to your healthy eating routine or your uh, exercise routine? Let's talk about that today. It's Kathy here with Weight Loss God's Way. And today I want to talk to you about discipline. I was reading the scripture uh, in Hebrews 12, 11, and it talks about discipline that doesn't seem fun or, or pleasant at the time, but it brings about peace and righteousness for those who are trained by it. And uh, it's a real good way to reframe discipline, to think of it instead of this torture or this punishment or this hard thing. What if you saw discipline as a gift from God, a blessing for your righteousness to give you peace I know it's a hard reframe, but we struggle with discipline, right? You're forever trying to, if only I could be more disciplined, if only I could eat better. And the truth is, God's word says that it's our, it's a training. If you ever gone to the gym and you work out, you know that it hurts. <laughs> Those weights hurt when you push them or walking or running on the treadmill, you get to the point you're like, I can't do this anymore and we wanna stop. But it's that resistance that makes us stronger. It's that fatiguing, tiring of the muscle when the muscles grow and helps our body to burn fat. So my encouragement to you today is to change the way that you think about discipline and take it as a gift as an opportunity for peace, for righteousness, to learn what the Lord has you to learn in your health journey or in other areas of your life. Learn from it, let it be your training ground and know that it it will produce good fruit if you allow the Lord to discipline you. And that's something else is, are you trying to discipline yourself? Are you trying to force yourself to change? Or are you allowing the Lord to discipline you? And that's another, I thought that just came to me as I was sharing this, is sometimes that we struggle with discipline because we're trying to make ourselves do things. And so surrender the discipline to the Lord, invite him in, let him know that you want his discipline and just see what a difference that makes in your life is one, seeing discipline as a gift from God that uh, not everybody has the benefit of being trained by him. And two, seeing discipline from God's perspective instead of from your perspective. Amen. Give that a try. Think about it. Pray about it. Go to Hebrews 12, 11. Give me your comments maybe after studying that scripture and see if that'll change your perspective on Um, moving your body more, getting active, or even even eating healthier. Amen? All right. Uh, I look forward to sharing with you again. I share all things faith and health. If you're new to my channel, go ahead, hit subscribe, uh, and be sure to leave me comments. I love to reply to your comments. I love to hear how the Lord is speaking to you in my shares, okay? God bless you. Bye-bye.